Alright, I know I haven't posted in like seven or six days and I needed it just for my mental health and stuff and to be honest i feel good like i feel good after taking just not like a huge break but like just a week off just to go ahead and rearrange myself because during those times where i was posting five times a week monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday i was like so stressed out and was so focus on uploading youtube videos and not worrying about schoolwork and academic work to go ahead and get my grades up because this grade like i said is very important ninth grade it was easy this grade is not easy man you get homework almost every single day which is not fun at all man and it hurts like you don't want to go home and do homework man i just needed that break just to go ahead and rearrange myself rearrange stuff i needed to do because you know i had a lot of homework that time like i had a lot from math from social studies ela like i had a lot of classes i mean a lot of homework i had to do from those classes i would like to say i'm gonna come back to youtube uh but now i think I figure out what when to post and stuff. I think I'm gonna go ahead and post three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. By the time this video is up, which will be Friday, this video was recorded two days ago, which is Wednesday. But I think three times a week is gonna be better than Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, so I don't go ahead and burn myself completely out. Cause you know, when I was doing five days in a row, like I was completely burned out after editing the video and posting it. I did not want to go ahead and do homework and that's not a good thing to do at all, especially when you're in 10th grade. So Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays, I'm gonna post videos so that Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays, and Sundays, I go ahead and rearrange myself, worry about school, YouTube, and real life outside of school and outside of youtube because you know we all have our own lives you know you just think that if you're a youtuber you have a youtuber's life no you have your own life as well we're all humans so yeah i i, I figure it out three times a week is better than five days in a row because i'm only 15 and i'm not trying to go ahead and completely burn myself out yes i want to do youtube that is my goal my goal is to reach a million subs one day like that is one of my goals and hopefully make it but yeah i think three times a week will make it better for me and do less stress to me than five days in a row where it stresses me so much to the point where i, I felt lost i did get some books from the library at my school because you know i wanted to go ahead and gain more knowledge you know i, I feel like every time i'm doing homework and i'm done with stuff and chores and that i'm like let's go ahead and go on the phone but i feel like i'm wasting time from that and i want to go ahead and gain more knowledge and be more wise you know so I went ahead and got four books to read about self-knowledge and self, you know, how to help yourself more and, you know, to see who you are as, uh, as a person outside of the stuff where nobody sees you. And it's just you and your family and your cousins, whatever it is, right? So I got four books to read and hopefully I can gain a, uh, a lot of knowledge and wisdom from it because I'm trying to build up as a human being because as as they all say you start young it's gonna be better when you grow up so i'm pretty sure if i start reading these books one by one by one i'm gonna go ahead and go up as a human being step by step small steps every single day you know it doesn't matter if it's small steps medium steps big steps it doesn't matter every step ahead is always better than no steps so i'm gonna go ahead and read those books man hopefully I could go ahead and gain some knowledge and some wisdom because at a young age of 15 i feel like when i'm in my 20s i'm pretty sure that people who i work with in a job and i'm in like i don't know whatever job i go to filmmaking whatever it is by the way filmmaking is like my second option if youtube doesn't work i feel like if i go ahead and have more wisdom and get my vocab up and be more wise then people will be like yep he's a he's a wise man intelligent all of that so hopefully 
I go go ahead and gain a lot of wisdom and knowledge and you know stuff like that to go ahead and develop myself as a human being also I've been journaling because I heard journaling helps you a lot so writing things of like what's good that's happened what's bad what can you do to overcome it and stuff like that and I feel like it is gonna help me a lot especially as of this stage right now because we're three weeks into high school well 10th grade and it's definitely tiring and stressful but at the same time I don't want to just be on my phone and waste my time instead of going ahead and reading a book which is more better than wasting time on social media I'm back on YouTube. I'm gonna post three times a week now instead of five days in a row so I could go ahead and rearrange myself and rearrange my schedule. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, like I said, by the time this video is posted on Friday, this video was recorded on Wednesday. So yeah, hope you guys have a good day. It's been Ibrahim and I'm out. Peace. Okay, so these are the four books that I'm gonna read that gains my knowledge and wisdom. The first one is The Power of, of uh, Positive No, How to Say No and Still Get to Yes. The second one is Ignite Your Spark, Discovering Who You Are from the Inside Out. The third book is The Six Most Important Decisions you Ever Make as a Teenager. And the fourth and final book, and I think this one's gonna be my favorite one, is Ethical Ambition, Living a Life of Meaning and Worth by Derek Bell. And also, my journal.